space, travel, terror that we're pretty familiar with, whether in comic books, TV shows or movies, but is it possible and how? Hello, my name is Imamani and today I'm going to answer this question. According to Einstein's theory of general relativity, space-time tunnels, also known as wormholes or Einstein roads and bridges, are the only logical way to space-time travel. A wormhole is visualized as a shortcut connecting two points in the space, whether they are long distances or just short distances such as few meters. It can also be, in some cases, a longer than normal path. According to the physicist Neil deGrasse, any presence of mass or energy would wrap the fabric of space and time, creating a wormhole. Now, whether wormholes actually exist remains to be seen, but if they did exist, wormholes are predicted to exist on microscopic levels. However, as the universe expands, it is possible that some may have been stretched, allowing human trouble, but we wouldn't survive anyway, as traveling through a wormhole can instantly collapse it, even if the tiniest amount of matter attempted to pass through it, because according to Einstein's equation of relativity, wormholes are very, very unstable and has other dangers such as radiation for example. Also, these magical tunnels would allow faster than light travel. Perfect for sci-fi writers. A wormhole is symbolized with two holes at each end, one black hole as an interest and one white hole as an exist. As I suppose, we're pretty familiar with the term black hole, if you're not, don't worry, I'll explain. Black hole is what forms at the end of the life cycle of one of the stars we see in our beautiful night sky, so when it runs out of fuel to keep it together, it collapses forming a black hole that absorbs everything near it, from matter to planets and even light can't escape. But what is a white hole? A white hole is the total opposite of a black hole. It acts as a source that ejects matter coming from the other end of the wormhole, aka black holes, into another universe. Another way to imagine wormholes is to take a sheet of paper and draw two distant points, aka two different places in space, representing a distance to be traveled. A wormhole could connect these two points by folding the paper, so the points are now touching. Some people and even scientists believe that the Big Bang might in fact have been a result of such a phenomenon. So where did we truly came from? 